Hello, my name is Jeanette and I'm a craft artist here at Sizzix. Today I'm going to be sharing some tips and techniques for using our ink sheets. And in case you're not familiar with our ink sheets, they're dry ink transfers that allow you to add colorful accents to your crafts and projects. So here's our packaging and these are just a few of the color options that we offer. There are others. So now let's start on our first technique. I'm going to be showing you how to convert all your thin lit dies or wafer thin dies that you might have into stamps. And we're going to be working with our Big Shot today. And the sandwich for this is you're going to need a magnetic platform, an ink sheet transfer pad, our cardstock, an ink sheet, and I'm going to be using the green and you want to put this shiny side up. You also want to make sure to remove the protective film that it comes with and set that aside. And the thin lit dies that I'm going to be working with are some Stephanie Ackerman sentiments. So they say happy, love, uh, home. They're really cute. So we're just going to set those down. And then we're going to put a cutting pad on top and we're going to roll it through. Now you're not going to feel a lot of pressure, but that's completely normal. So don't worry about that part. And this is the really fun part is removing the ink sheet to reveal a perfectly stamped thinlet. So here's the result of our stamping. And if you look over here, here are some examples of how you can use your ink sheets to spruce up your projects. 